What's up, my YouTube brothers and sisters? This is Rockbro43 coming at you with uh, a Basher lineup update. Um, I picked up a Basher on Tuesday that I've been waiting on. Uh, Pre-order uh, finally came in. Uh, didn't get a chance to do a video till today. So I'm going to show you what it is. I'm going to do it real quick. It's already out of the box. Um, I'm probably going to do one more Basher lineup video when everything is complete to let you see what I'm going to be bashing this season and then I'm going to get back to the speed run uh, videos I actually got uh, another RC that I added to the lineup plus I'm working on a drag car as well so I'll get all that together and do a let you guys see what I'm working with on the speed run side as well um, so Real quick, I'll show you what I got going on. Uh, shout out to the 70 plus club members. Um, shout out to all the guys that are trying to get in. Uh, and big shout out to just the RC family in general. Whatever you're doing in the RC world, you know, one big family. So uh, I'll get to the video. Give me a chance to set up and I'll be right back. <laughs> Alright guys, I'm back. Um, as you can see... Uh, the new addition to the Basher lineup is the Traxxas Unlimited Desert Truck. Um, I took the body off off camera because uh, you have to take out 12 screws. <clears throat> and if you can see these slots here, you have to maneuver it around this bumper. So it took me a little bit to get it off. Um, so I didn't want to waste a bunch of time, so I did it off camera. Uh, there's a, a lot of unboxings out there for this RC so I'm not gonna really get too in depth uh, for me to show like the system inside I would have had to take a bunch of screws out and you know so it's a VXL 6S system with a 2200 KV um, they did a really awesome job like replicating the truck to make it look like the real thing I thought they did an awesome job there's a couple questionable pieces on there uh, that I won't I won't find out like the answers to until I bash it whether they're durable or not um, I did have a I was hoping I was gonna be able to use my 6s batteries I have some I have four 6s batteries that I was gonna use in a different uh, project but the project fell through so I was hoping to be able to use it in this RC uh, but the batteries don't fit. It, it'll fit a four cell single battery and then two two cells and two three cells. But I was hoping to be able to just one, run one uh, battery pack in there. Also, um, yesterday I went to go get the female plugs for my batteries so that I can bash today but uh, they didn't have the female plugs and now they you know Traxxas uses the ID system so that the batteries don't have the lead on it but the plug has uh, some kind of uh, wire in it that lets the charger know what cell the battery is so I found out yesterday that the old TRX plugs will plug into the new uh, ESC plug so that was a good thing so I had to order them I didn't get them yet but once I get them I'll do some bashing and let you guys know what I feel about it um, so far you know other than the battery not being able to fit and the uh, connectors um, still I still like the car I think it's awesome um, I like how they replicated made it look like the real thing uh, the shocks are awesome. Sorry for all the moving around. But the parts that I was worried about was the sway, the sway bar assemblies. Like they look kind of cheap. Um, but other than that, uh, the A-arms are real solid. Looks real durable. And like I said, the GTR shocks are awesome. Um, I like how they got the real look. Uh, fans and the fire extinguisher. Uh, this drive shaft here, the rear uh, center drive shaft is usable, so it's extra. I thought that was cool. Um, also, the extra tires. thought that was awesome. 
So I'm pretty pleased with it, you know. Just got to get out there and get some bash runs in. The awesome thing about getting on the basher side of the hobby is I can go right outside and do it. So that's that's cool. Um, like I said, sorry for all the movement. Uh, just wanted to show you, you know, what I added to the lineup. Uh, once I should have my Pro MT 4x4, the Pro Line truck, and my X Max done today. I'll do a final bash your lineup video to show you all of them um, and then I'm gonna get back to the speed run side I got a couple cars that I I'm gonna have done in the next couple of days plus I have a new addition to the speed runs plus I'm building a uh, bandit um, drag car and I'll you know let you guys know where I got all them parts from uh, when I do that build so you know I guess that's it for now um, again shout out to the, uh, the RC community as a whole you know whether you're droning or bashing or everything in between um, you know shout out to the RC family so uh, with that being said um, till the next video peace